Okay, gonna try this again here, see what we get. I believe the microphone is active this time, so we'll connect, get the data flowing. There we go. And here was that first bug I, I mentioned earlier. I think it has something to do with the board might have just reset when I connected to it. So if I uh, kill it and reconnect, again, these are just your normal annoying bugs that you see in software all the time. And uh, this is no exception. But we're connected now. You can see all the displays are live. And you'll see it comes up if you look at the throttle. You'll notice 1500. Uh, I'm actually sending minimum right now from the transmitter. If I bring my transmitter up, you'll see that reset. See, now we're actually coming up with live data. So when the software comes up, or it, it's, it's not showing the, the actual minimal throttle, I'm saying it comes up at 1500 for some reason. I'm not sure what that's all about. It's not terrible. I mean, I can reset it just by moving the throttle, and boom, now we're actually looking at live throttle data. Our motors are not armed right now. Um, you'll see it's responding normal if I move the throttle up and down. But if I jerk it quick, like that, did you notice it's at, at 11.50 now? And it didn't come back down to zero, even though I did move my stick down to zero. I'm holding it down as hard as it'll go, and I'm moving the uh, yaw control here. And we're stuck at 11.50, even though I'm sending uh, minimum throttle, which uh, would normally show up as 1,000. So if I just barely touch the stick here, it immediately resets to, you know, where it's showing the normal range again. If I really jerk it fast, starting from minimal, and it's only if you start, I can jerk it anywhere here, and I believe it behaves normal. It's only when you come all the way down, then you jerk it like that. See, we're, we're stuck at two points above. It's not much, but it's a little. But if I really, sometimes it'll really stick way up there. Now we're at 1322 you know, stuck where I'm sending minimal throttle, but it's stuck at 1322. So it's just really weird. Sometimes it'll stick way up at 1800, you know, depending on how fast you jerk it. There, we're stuck at 1500, something right there. And of course, in this state, the motors will not arm at all, even though I'm, you know, throttle all the way down and I'm trying to arm. This would happen in the field when I was testing and I'd be frustrated, like, why the heck won't this thing arm? What's going on? It's all the way down, it won't arm, boom. So this is what's actually going on behind the scenes, is it's stuck. And if I just move it a little bit, boom, we're cleared. And now we just arm the motors. So the motors are spinning now. <laughs> and I'm going to show the, uh, they respond normally if you go slow. Things are about right, all the controls look, yeah. So, everything behaves, bring her down, we're at idle again, but if I jerk it, see it sticks just like it did before, only now the motors are live, and hey, we're out of control, I cannot disarm the motors, so this would happen out in the field and freak me out as well, but, uh, anyway, we're, we're stuck with motors above idle there, even though I'm sending minimum throttle, until I bring the throttle back up, and then the motors actually drop. <laughs> It's just really weird. If you do it fast, up and down, it sticks. See, we're stuck there. And you cannot disarm. And now I can disarm once I do that, but... So now we're stuck at 1400, 1458, and you'll hear the motor's just sitting there kind of climbing and drifting around a little bit. Not bring the throttle down. You know, the only way to bring the throttle down is to bring it back up a little bit. It resets to a thousand, and that's the sound. So anyway, I thought I'd do one more take on the video there with some narration. So hope you. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what's causing all that, but I am curious. It'd be nice to fly this thing sometime.